the epic trilogy, Manas Semete Seitek has a special place in the life of the Kyrgyz people. How many people followed the endless caravan of the great epic? This caravan passed roads of millenniums. Well-known scholars and writers have believed the Kyrgyz epic trilogy to be the encyclopedia of Kyrgyz life. Daily life of the Kyrgyz people, from birth to death, their habits and customs, diplomatic and trade relations, ethical norms, as well as religious, medical and geographic and other views are reflected in this epic trilogy. That's why the trilogy is an abundant source for studying history, philosophy, ethnography, verbal art, psychology and other aspects of the Kyrgyz people's life. The trilogy is based on the principle of genealogical cyclization and consists of three integrated independent epic parts. Manas, Semete, and Seitek. Its foundation and central theme is the story about heroic deeds of the Kyrgyz heroes. Manas, his son Semete, and grandson Seitek committed for the sake of uniting the scattered Kyrgyz tribes and establishing Kyrgyz statehood. The general ideological foundation of the trilogy is associated with the longing to preserve unity of people, their statehood and establishment of peaceful life. Heroes of the epic trilogy, Manas, Semete and Seitek, are symbols of courage and unity of the Kyrgyz people. And therefore, one may say that the role of this Kyrgyz epic trilogy is to give rise to national consciousness. Traditionally, the epic trilogy is narrated at large celebrations, during national holidays and various local gatherings and events. The epic trilogy was developing gradually, from generation to generation, from century to century. Through efforts of epic tellers, it became to be core of epic heritage, which includes new historical events and characters, and becomes more complicated in its plot structure. The modern epic trilogy is a unique element of the Kyrgyz intangible cultural heritage, which incorporates genres of folklore, lamentations, proverbs and sayings, social rituals and customs, traditional knowledge related to nature and humanity. All these components are united in the framework of the Epic Trilogy. Another important feature of the Epic Telling is what has come to be known as the Ayan phenomenon. This is not a well-studied phenomenon yet and it is reflected in acquiring narrative skills through inspiration from heaven. It can be likened to the state of trance, where a channeler receives poetic skills and ability to describe historical events and facts during improvised performance. The most comprehensive and highly artistic versions of the epic trilogy are the ones written from such epic tellers as Sagumbay Orazbakov and Sayakbay Karalayev. It is their versions that compose the classic written epic trilogy Manas Semete Seite. The name Sayakbay Karalayev speaks for itself. We all understand our great epic stands behind this name. In total, there are more than 85 versions of the epic trilogy that have been written from different epic tellers. This also includes the version of Jusuf Mamai, 
the Kyrgyz Manas narrator who lives in China. All the versions reflect the general plot of the entire epic trilogy, and at the same time, they contain and reflect the individuality of each epic teller. In contemporary culture, the epic trilogy considered as the most popular element of traditional art thus gained extensive development and is being reproduced in various forms of performing arts and film production. The Kyrgyz literature was based on the epic trilogy tales. Even now it is still being replenished by different motives and images of the epic heritage. Today, for the purpose of safeguarding and disseminating the trilogy among successors, training studios are being established, young epic tellers are being trained, and they will continue the tradition of the great epic telling. <laughs> Representative list of the intangible cultural heritage of humanity as a unique platform for cooperation between cultures. By learning the elements, the list, people learn characteristics of different cultures and deepen their knowledge about each other. The Kyrgyz epic trilogy, Manas Semetei is a monument created by the nomadic culture in this way, it will give the opportunity to learn and understand the value of not only Kyrgyz culture, but also nomadic civilization in general. It will certainly become an impetus to further rapprochement of not only cultures, but also civilizations. In addition, the need for Kyrgyzstan's applying to inscribe the epic trilogy Manas Semetei Seitek in the representative list has very serious grounds. The epic trilogy cannot be divided into parts. Manas Semetei Seitek represents three epics of one big Kyrgyz epic heritage. They are like three large rivers flowing into an ocean, the name of which is the Kyrgyz epic trilogy.